I just got a Thunder 3G Elite by Ghost Holsters for my Shadow 2 Carry Optics. Let's check this thing out. What's up everyone? Thanks for stopping by. Today I want to go over Ghost Holsters Thunder series. That'll be the Thunder, Thunder 3G, and Thunder Elite, and Thunder 3G Elite. Uh, so you can know what the differences are between them. I'm going to be reviewing the Thunder 3G Elite, which is their top line that has all their features on it for my CZ Shadow 2. If you're thinking about getting any Ghost products, you can use my code, which is COBRA! And that'll save you 10% off and let them know that the Cold Cobra sent you their way. All right, so this is what the Thunder 3G Elite looks like all boxed up. I'm using it for my CZ Shadow 2, milled for carry optics by Primary Machine with the Leopold Delta Point Pro with my cool Cobra brass lock grips. All right, so let's open the box and see what is inside. Uh, we have an Allen wrench taped to the top, instruction manual, cardboard that we don't need and the actual holster itself. So you can see that the quick detach mount is what makes it the 3G, and then the Elite is this ledger lining inside, actually is nice and thin. I should protect the uh, slide or the frame of my pistol pretty well. Let's actually put it inside just to see how smooth it is and nice. Yeah, so actually let me adjust the tension real quick. This is straight from the box. Ooh, that's nice and smooth. So, this is what it looks like. I actually like the color scheme of the hanger being red and the attachment to the uh, actual Kydex holster itself being blue because they are Cobra colors because I am the cold Cobra when I shoot USPSA. Cobra time! Cobra! So this is actually my third Thunder holster from Ghost. Uh, my first one was actually for Beretta 92A1. That was actually my very first USPSA production rig that I ever bought. <laughs> So the thing I like about the Thunder holsters is that the Kydex is actually very, very thin and lightweight, but also very, very strong. You don't have a very heavy holster hanging on your body all day. And the texture on the outside of the holster is actually quite nice. Cobra! If you already have their magazine pouches with their quick detach system, it is the same quick detach system that's on the 3G and 3G Elite. It's very, very easy to operate. You just pull this and then it lifts up and then to put it back in place. Just snaps into place like so. So I have two other hanger bodies here. The first is from my first Thunder holster from my Beretta 92A1, and it is for expert shooters only. All joking aside though, I never really liked this hanger body system because if you didn't tighten this screw down all the way, it could flex and you're gonna move out of position. So I never really used this hanger body. I used a different hanger body system. But if you buy their current Evo ones, which is the race holsters, or uh, a non 3G Thunder, this is what it would come with. This is made out of steel. You can actually notice compared to the 3G hanger body, it sits about an inch or two inches lower because the rotation point is that screw there. You can see that the rotation point would be down here. You can also see how high it, uh, how high it sits compared to the top of the belt. Top of the belt would be here, and this is the back of the grip. I like having the back of my grip even with the top of my belt. So it's about two inches too high for uh, for my liking. Um, other than that, the system's pretty great, but uh, I just wish that they would have a lower hanger body that you can adjust higher if you wanted to. But uh, this is what it looks like. You can actually tell how high it sits. But I do like the quick detach mount if you're trying to use multiple holsters for the same competition rig. So one final thing to note about the Thunder for my Shadow 2 is that it actually looks like it's for three different uh, pistol platforms. It's for the SPL1, Shadow 2, and the Tankfolio Stock 3. So if you have this ghost holster you can actually use it for several different models of pistols which is actually quite nice all right be sure to like and subscribe as i'll be doing a lot more reviews of ghost holster products as i'm one of their sponsored shooters and as always be sure to train hard so when the time comes you can strike like a coiled cobra